I never get to know things before other people. It's it's so hard. <laughs> this is probably why. It's been so hard to keep this secret. I've known for like two weeks that Gods and Monsters, or the game formerly known as Gods and Monsters, <laughs> that completely disappeared, by the way, Ubisoft. I was really excited to play it on Switch when it was supposed to release back in February, but then nothing happened. It just, it just disappeared. Ubisoft, Ubisoft, I call it Ubisoft. They asked, hey, um, so that game, yeah, it's still coming. We've changed the name, we've changed some things, and you can play it like two weeks before we even announce that it's releasing. I do have to say, though, I am actually streaming the game from Ubisoft servers. I don't have the game. I don't, it's not here with me. And it's also technically a work in progress build. That said, I was very, very surprised by how well it played considering I was streaming it. By the way, this video, it's even sponsored by Ubisoft. Yes, I'm getting paid to play this game early. I would have done it for free <laughs> and in the presentation they showed us this game looks like it's evolved into something And again, I don't know if I can say this it kind of looks like breath of the wild 2 came early and I'm completely okay with it Oh, we're gonna have a good time today. <laughs> and if you are impressed by how fun this game is, you can find a link down below in the description if you wanna check this game out today. And uh, please click that link, because it really helps support the channel. Also, it's a really fun game. <laughs> That's enough of a long blabby intro. I am way too excited to play this. <laughs> Tell me you're not excited to play this on Switch. Oh, you can actually I kind of want to see what's down there. Investigate. Oh, I'm supposed to be going this way. Oops. Oops. I ran out of stamina. <laughs> Wait, summon mount? Oh, you can just summon it? Well, no, nah, that's good. Now I know I won't be losing my horse all the time and have to go to... I'm not going to make comparisons here. <laughs> yeah, so in the presentation they gave us, they highlighted how many different ways there was to traverse the land. You can climb up stuff. You can fly. You can ride your horse. You also have stamina. Again, I don't know. I don't know if I'm allowed to say it, but I, I think it's very clear that it's heavily inspired or influenced. I'm really okay with it. Again, it, it has so much of its own character already, I can tell. Oh. You can climb on anything. I like that. <laughs> they have plopped me kind of like in the middle of the game. So we have some things unlocked. My character is kind of set up already. Oh, oh, oh no. How do I? Oh. Oh yeah, there's air combat. I forgot about that. You can fight in the air. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that combat is smooth. Oh, I have abilities. Oh my god! Whoa, what did he just turn into a golem somehow? I like I, I like did some Phoenix raining fire from the sky thing. I'm so happy I'm finally playing this game. Oh, I just oh I just oh this might be a fantasy game, but even we have limits. Yeah, so something that's actually cool, the voiceover was tailored for this demo. And these voice actors do voice over the game, but this one is tailored to us. It's pretty cool. There we go. There we go. Oh, no. Some nice telekinesis there. Oh that's new. Nice in here how do we get in here oh you know what i bet you know what i bet this is a secret door that you don't have to open but if you're smart you can do anything <laughs> I like the way she just taps on the chest to open it so i believe there are a ton of these puzzle challenge rooms around the world you can find and each one you knock one out you get a zeus lightning bolt that you can use to upgrade yourself it reminds me of a little game i can't uh, tip of my tongue, I can't quite. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna we're gonna beat these dudes. <clears throat> oh, where did you come from? Wait, is that helping me? I don't think that thing cares who it is. Get out of here. Oh, look at the bear! I don't know if you're friendly, but I'm not killing you no matter what. He's so cute! <laughs> I wanna be their friend. Ubisoft, I know the game. It's coming out in like December, I, but <laughs> there's still time. Allow me to feed the bears, okay? This combat is really smooth. 
All right, I staggered him. Oh, easy. Coming in for the big hammer. <laughs> I like the way that they just... <laughs> Team Rocket's blasting off again. All right, guys, I'm coming in hot and fast. <laughs> Get ready. Oh, no, I ran out of stamina again. Oh, we got robots now. Oh, my gosh. Stop shooting me. Yeah. Yeah, your ground pounds do nothing to me. I'm an angel of the Lord, maybe. Probably not. Go, my phoenix. Go, my beautiful phoenix. I want to finish him with a massive swing, so we have to get him. Oh, but never mind. Never mind. Uh, heal, heal. Whoa. All right, you ready? I think that should be good. Boom. I'm annoyed because I have to wait till December to play the rest of the game like everyone else. <laughs> they should just give me the game now. I gotta open that barrier. Well, can I just fly over it? I mean, I'm, I have wings. Maybe it's not me that that barrier is trying to keep out. It's probably these blocks, right? Can I touch that thing? Does that hurt? Yes. Okay. All right. Okay, 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 okay. I'll just take, I'll just take the hit. It's okay. All right, but I still got to get one on the other one. Those bad boys aren't getting out of there. Can I bring like this rock? All right, if I can just bring some random rock into this party, I'll actually like that a lot because that's giving the player a lot of freedom to solve puzzles whatever way they want. <laughs> yeah, that's so good. Enemy attacks glow red cannot be parried. Oh, I didn't even know they could be parried. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's a boss. Oh, it's a boss. Hey, it's fine. I'll figure this out. I got health pots for days. This is so good. I think, I think maybe like, you know, maybe I'm too good. Do you ever think that you maybe you're too good? <laughs> you're done. You're done. Get out of here. Wow, that's pretty cool. So all of that was triggered real time in the game. Like we worked our way through all of that quest mission stuff to the top of that tower. The boss battle was there waiting for us. There was no loading. And as soon as we built the boss, this thing like exploded from the sky and we just got to work flying towards it. There's no load screens. This is all happening real time in the world. That is really exciting. It makes the entire story in the world cohesive. It makes it all feel alive. Oh gods, no, I have a better idea. How about you tell me all about it this holiday season? Wink? Did you just say wink out loud? Anyway, let's see what this place has to explore. Puzzles, vaults, I'm sure there's a lot to see. I think that was my little hint and clue that the story is over for this demo, but now I'm free to explore the world. Also that little hint that it's coming out holiday season. I'm guessing I'm allowed to say it now because I'm, I'm also guessing you would have seen this today, but the game comes out December 3rd. So pretty soon. I mean, we're already in September. I'm so glad that this horrible year is almost over. I really am. And at least there's some really cool stuff to look forward to at the end of the year like the new consoles and this game. I really haven't even dived into the menu here. I think I did unlock some new- Oh! Your character is fully customizable. So you can find helmets, you can find armor, you can find different wings, you can customize your mounts. You have all these godly powers which you can upgrade in a variety of different ways. And then, you have this whole map. Everything from this video today has all been in this area in the Forge Lands, but there's other areas too, and they're all themed different, you know, forest, desert, water, etc. Okay, so now I guess we just explore. There are a couple of side quest things and then other secrets that we can discover. Ubisoft just said to run wild and have a good time. So in the interest of exploring, how about we dive bomb? Oh, I ran out of juice. I wonder if Ubisoft is watching me play right now. Maybe this game's too easy because this guy is just making it look so good. Little do they know, I'm just really good at games. I would hate to think that they're going to end up making this game harder because I'm kind of beta testing it and making it look easy because I know everyone else would probably struggle with it. I'm just really good. <laughs> oh, I got to take the arrow, light it on fire, and then light that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't get me with these kinds of puzzles. I know that little jingle. I did something good. Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh. 
new visual. Oh, okay. So it really is very customizable. And can I customize the sword? Oh, I can. I can customize the sword. Oh, I love when games do that. So I can have that sword equipped for the stats. But if I like the look of one of my old swords more, I can... That's neat. Oh! Oh! Hello, bud. Can I just steal this and be on my way? I can't. Hold on. Oh, no. It's a. Hey, let me open it. Oh, I can't open it. Oh, he's so big. Get him in the eye. I know how this works. Oh, my gosh. He's so strong. Yikes! I don't have enough health potions. This is tough. I don't know what these other potions do, but I'm hitting them. <sighs> okay, I'm not ready for big green man. <laughs> okay, so after my devastating loss against that green giant thing, Ubisoft, who's on Discord with me, they said, if I want more potions, now that I've blasted through all of mine, I can go make more at uh, these purple potions on the map. Oh yeah, I can make more. Potion upgrades increase health to refill nine chunks. Okay, I've used all the upgrades. And then, how do I make... Oh, 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 oh! Okay, we have our potions. I don't have enough to make all of the health potions I would like. But we have strength potions, and we have defense potions, and stamina potions, and then six health ones. I've ran out of my allotted time, but I told them I at least want to try beating him one more time. If we can beat him, good. If we don't, I'm going to be up every night until the game comes out thinking about... Okay, I'm back. You ain't get- Oh, my horse! <laughs> I'm coming in, bud. I'm going to immediately die here. Move, move, move! Oh, I did, I did. I'm actually doing okay! Oh, wait, my potion. Okay, so if I blast in the air when he does that foot move, I'm actually parrying, believe it or not. Oh, he's almost staggered! I'd be able to. This is an actual smile of joy on my face because I didn't. I honestly thought I will go try and tackle that thing one last time just so the video has somewhere to end. But I did it, which is good because the first time it was it seemed impossible. But once you put a little put a brain power into it and you and you start to learn the enemy, it's really not that bad at all. Ugh, man. It sucks that I have to wait, but I will say it's exciting because I still haven't played the Switch version. When I get that in my hands and I can play it on my TV or in bed or whatever and start my new journey from the beginning, I'm really excited. And I think this is a game that would be fun to play through on Twitch with you guys, so I might even just play most of it on Twitch. We'll see. I had so much fun playing this. I remember when I was a kid going to a game store the day before Gears 3 released and I managed to convince the guy working at the game store to give me the game the day before because because they were closing and it was like, you know, kind of just sold it to me and he said, don't tell anyone. And I remember going home that night being the only one out of my friends that had gears and being the the envy of the town. All of my friends were like, how did you get that a day early? <laughs> but now here I sit, sponsored by Ubisoft to play a game I've been really excited about, not just a day early, but weeks early before it's even announced. I do have to say, while I couldn't help but draw some comparisons to other games that are also really awesome that I love, this game more than stands out on its own, with its own personality, its own charm, its own fast-paced, high-octane hack-and-slash action. It definitely stands out as its own thing. I really love what they've done with it. It seems they really took the game and they spun it up and they changed a lot of things. It, it's really fun. So thank you guys so much for giving me this platform to do this. Thank you Ubisoft, Ubisoft, Ubisoft for uh, sponsoring the video and allowing me to do this. It was a really cool uh, opportunity, a really cool moment for me. And hey, if you let me pet the bears or feed the bears, this game goes from a 10 out of 10 to a, to a 15 out of 10. Give me that, Ubisoft. Also, let me be a voice actor in one of your games. How many things can I can I rope into here at the end? Let me in, Ubisoft. I'll be a part of it. I'll be I'll be involved. I can be one of these gods. I'm, I'm the great great god, god of ending, ending this video. This video. <laughs> All right, guys. Bye. Thank you.